Drugs in schools is a constant concern, but one tri-state high school says they've come up with a unique solution. This is Natty. Our Robert Guadarrama takes us inside Fairfield High School, where administration is using this four-legged faculty member how to keep drugs and guns away from campus. A warm, sunny school day at Fairfield High. Most would say a normal spring semester day. But these halls are anything but ordinary. That's because they are monitored by the most vigilant, dedicated, and well, good fine girl. cutest security guard around. Okay, good girl. Through a grant process, uh, they were awarded a dog here. Uh, that's a drug prevention. Uh, it's also a little bit of a therapy dog for some of our students. It's a nice uh, sort of mascot for our school. Her name is Natty. The German Shepherd reports for duty every school day. Not here. With her handler and fellow campus security guard, Randy. There's not one student who doesn't know Natty. In a school vote, Natty would undoubtedly win most popular. Good girl. She's always playing, licking on everybody. There's never a time that I've seen her where she just hasn't wanted to play. That's her big thing. Natty's favorite game to play is tug of war, but she knows when it's time to go to work. The idea of Natty is that that's a pre preventative force. The kids see her every day uh, roaming the halls and they understand what her purpose is, that she does uh, work the lockers every day. So our hope is that, that that is another step for kids to make the decision not to bring any sort of narcotics or drugs into the building. Principal William Rice says that's where Natty plays an invaluable role. As a visible deterrent with a sensory skill set his human security guards don't have, her nose. Natty's handler, Randy Johnson, says his partner is trained to detect various types of drugs, as well as gunpowder. Her detection is she sits and stares. Mm -hmm. uh, we knew she was going to be in school, so we didn't train her to bark. And Natty is the real deal. She's a certified canine. As a matter of fact, she trains alongside police dogs twice a month. We work every other Wednesday with Fairfield Police and their canines to keep her training up. But Natty being Natty, she has a little more fun than her furry colleagues on the force. She goes into the training room and most of the dogs come in and you got to stand real still, but she comes in and she has to get petted by every officer before she goes and, and takes her turn running uh, to check for drugs. And how successful has she been here on campus in deterring uh, students from bringing drugs on? Uh, it's been less every year. Yeah. yeah, she's been very good deterrent. Um, uh, each year found less. Come on. In fact, Fairfield City Schools report a 42% drop in busts since Natty started patrolling the halls. She definitely um, scares some of the students in here, so scares them to the point where they know not to bring drugs in the building. I feel like students in general are too scared to do anything because they think that Natty will get them where they need to be got. And though Natty has superior focus, there are two scenarios that pose a slight distraction. Those mischievous squirrels. Check it. Check squirrel. Good girl. And the mysterious wonder that is the school elevator. Only time she'll be on a dead sprint is if she's going to the elevator. That's her favorite thing, riding the elevator. Cool. A true mascot, one that protects the halls. A good girl. While filling them with smiles and laughter. Good girl. In Fairfield. Robert Guadarrama, Fox 19, now. Oh, everybody knows I love a story about a good fur baby. Oh, well,